to my channel uh, out here on my back deck this will be my first video uh, so I'm dealing with camera getting the use of all the cameras things like that uh, uh, let's see dog man homestead that's because I got dogs they're spoiled it's just me here I bought this house eight years ago it was nasty and I've been working on it ever since and I've got all the photos of what it was and what it what it is now and we're going to do a lot more in the future so uh, subscribe and hope you enjoy the videos well these are my chickens that's Waddles the rooster he was born with a birth defect he walks like a North Korean soldier walk for him Waddles Boss said kill them. I took them home. And all these hens, they're old hens. And they didn't have a future, so I took them home too. Got a nice little nesting box in there. Got some green peppers for you guys. There's Miss Rooster, my apprentice. Well, that went pretty good. I spent more time looking for tools and the actual repair. And then I lost a... Had trouble with the... Uh, one nut or bolt on the brake caliber. I should have bought a new one, but we'll be all right. And man, I hardly even got dirty, man. Hardly even got dirty. That's how you know you're doing all right. Just didn't even hardly get dirty. So when you old, old you know, got old trucks like this, you just got to know what to do. All right, man. We're done with that project. Let me dream up another one. Should have worn my short shorts today. Yeah. Mm, humidity. Mm. Let me do the nervous hospital. Mm. Mm. All right, then. All right, then. Let's get to it. Mm. That's swing blade. Old school. Kids, this is called a handsaw. You use your hand back and forth. This is how America was built. There you go, that's bigger than you. Oh, there's a chewer. Stick time. Come here, bring me the stick. Bring it. You gonna bring me the stick? For stick. Yeah. Little booger. Get your stick. I've got a new friend. What are you chewing on? My pants? Oh, a stick. We'll get it. And the wood chipper's running. I single handedly repaired it. <laughs> you know, just like I cut all this timber myself, Terry, I had to come to the rescue here. So. <laughs> Well, we all know that's a bunch of garbage. <laughs> and here I'm teaching these guys how to fix this thing. They broke it. We wasn't even running five minutes. And they broke it. So I'm making them twist the wrench this time. And then you came from Wisconsin, wow. yep. the Dallas Ooh. area. Thank you so much. Uh, Dave from Hood's Custom Shop in Missouri. Yeah. Yeah. Bob from local Havana. Yeah. Mark Dogman Homestead. We don't have a chance. 
channel yet. All right, that's good. Yes. Uh, we got Lindsay back there. Sherry Applicant, uh -huh. Tiny House, new yeah. to Arkansas. Yeah. 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 Big Dreams Homestead. Yeah. Oh, yeah. How long have you been here? Since March. Yeah, March so new. Month. And behind them, the Grady's. Yep. How long have you been here? Yeah, there. You're getting there. Three months. Been in Arkansas three months from Colorado. Yes. And Gage, who's going to town on the Firewood Shelter. Yeah, dude. Paul Beardy Carpenter. And Mel and Abe and Gary's over there. And Anthony YJ and the Black Plain Country Road Cure. There, Possum Run Homestead, also new to Arkansas. Two months. Fred and Deborah, the wood chipper, the the screen back door. So and much help. And El Butt Nuggets Homestead. And El yeah. Butt Nuggets Homestead. Yes. Thank you, thank you, thank you. The whole world thanks you. And I'm not going to over it. Oh, you're good. Oh, no. It's all gravy, bro. Well, I've got the other doors built. I haven't hung them yet. We're going to put that on video. And up there across the top, I don't know if you can see, I put a little railing. That made it look a whole lot better, I think. Nothing special. Now I can put my whatnots and what have you up there. Maybe put a doily on it. Nah, don't be sending me no doilies now. I ain't going to use no doilies. Or afghans or any of that stuff. You know, this is man's house. This is man cabin. I don't need no doilies up in here. All the rocks up. I've got it raked nice and level. Uh, I don't have enough of them to make it the size it was. I want to make them too high. So in order to do that, I'm going to have to make it smaller, which is fine. you'll have to excuse the wind uh, well I don't have any more of the blocks so, but that's fine because I need a spot like that right there to get in there and clean it out okay I've got all the cedar pulled off I've got the desktop gone what I need to do next is uh, pull, remove this wall and over on this side we have all this cedar I gotta take off and then I'll take the sheetrock off I also need to remove that light fixture that piece of rafter yeah. stringers 2 by 12s those are uh, 12 feet long plenty big enough and then I got a uh, 4 by 8 sheet of plywood 5 8 inch plywood those are gonna be my... <sighs> oh I'm glad they're done now these leaving them like this for now uh, when I get everything finished I'll pull these steps off if the woods decent I'll sand it down real good stain it whatever I'm gonna do I may replace it with good oak or something like that I don't know oh it is hot up here Hot, hot, hot. There's a few gaps in there I got to straighten up, but it's very time consuming making all them little pieces and uh, so I'm not going to get this project done in two or three days. It's going to be four or five probably. These are the boards I tore off of Jeff's uh, bubble at Bubblehead Homestead's porch. And I'm going to run some of these through the table saw. See if I can't salvage some of this cedar for slats. Alright, about got all the trimming done I can do for now. Uh, I just put this piece in, that piece in. 
Uh, I really can't do any more until I get these finished down here and get these new steps in. I took I'm going to work on building some handrails. Excuse me, some guardrails. There are differences. Guardrail is when there's no wall on one side. And a handrail is if you had a wall, a solid wall that you would attach a rail to. So there is a difference. Somebody, look at your apartment. Look at your beds. Look at your beds. Yeah, boy, they're excited. Let me put the fan on. Look at your beds. Don't pee on nothing, Waldo. Yeah. What do you think? Yeah, it's cool in here. Let me get the water. Thank you. 